for you. <laughs> Thanks, babe. No problem. You're the best. It's just for you. We made it and we're staying the night. <laughs> Good morning from Laguna. I have so much to update you guys on. Like I've had the craziest weekend so far. Brandon is um, going to get a banana or something really quick because he is starving this morning and I have like 15 minutes to get ready. So I'm just gonna update you guys while I get ready because I don't have a lot of time. I was gonna sit and chat, but I am not gonna do that now. So we are at this little hotel here in Laguna Beach and sorry this lighting is like not very cute. It's like very yellow. But anyways, I told you guys Brandon was going to be buying a new car in LA and so we had planned to leave to LA on saturday morning around 6 45 a.m so we got up yesterday because today's sunday and we were leaving on saturday so we got up yesterday at 4 a.m and we were on our way to the airport and our flight got delayed and we were like dang it so we went home and we waited a couple hours got back in the car and we were on our way to the airport again and the flight was delayed we we're like what is going on so we went to Starbucks and we were just going to wait the time at Starbucks and then our flight got delayed again and then again while we were at Starbucks. Like literally the flight had gotten delayed four times yesterday and the final time that it updated to was 10.30 p.m. From 6.44 a.m. departure time to 10.30 p.m. I was like, are you kidding me? So we ended up just like waiting all day yesterday in Vegas and went to the airport at 9 p.m. and flew into LAX at like 11.45. So we got here really late at night. We landed here in LAX and then we drove over to the guy's house that was like kind of by Manhattan Beach. and. We had like an Uber Black, this is like random, but the Uber was literally the nicest Uber I'd ever been in in my life. And we got to the house and the car is beautiful. Brandon did buy the car and I'll show it to you guys today. It's just like gorgeous. But we went to like a gas station and I was just like so tired. And then he was like, do you want to just like stay the night? And I was like, well, kind of. And so then he was on the phone for a sec and he goes, okay, we're going to Laguna. And I was like, what? He's like, yeah, I want to stay in Laguna. So we drove like 45 minutes last night to Laguna and we got this room here at the 14 Westin. And it's a really cute, like little room outside looks so cute. I can't really tell what it looks like because it was so dark last night i'm just getting ready because we're gonna have like coffee and breakfast and we're gonna look at the beach and then we're gonna go back to vegas just because we want to get back for the evening because we have plans tonight at home i was just so frustrated yesterday because we were supposed to have like the whole day in la and be able to go to the beach and stay the night and like have an entire weekend and then we just lost the whole day because of the flight delaying situation so yeah that was just like honestly the biggest bummer but it's okay like we still can have like a really fun morning and everything happens for a reason but yeah I just was like shocked that that kept happening. I was also worried too that like we were gonna get here and then he wasn't gonna like the car and then we weren't gonna buy it and then we'd have to get a rental car and drive back. So I'm just glad that the car is like what it was in the photos and the videos and that he really liked it and was like wanting to buy it because that would have just been a whole other situation. I need to get another hair tie. When we were leaving last night, I took a lot of stuff out of my bag because we weren't going to be staying. Like, I thought we were literally just going to drive 
that we were going to get the car and then drive like straight back and not stay. So I didn't like bring my Dyson Airwrap anymore. I didn't bring like any clothes. I just have like biker shorts and a Lululemon sports bra and then like a sweatshirt. So I'm just going to wear something like very casual, which is fine because we're not going to be here that long this morning and it'll be comfortable for the road trip back. But I'm so glad that I brought some stuff. Because I was, like, honestly debating on just bringing my purse. But then I was like, no. Like, if something happens, I should have, like, stuff with me. And Brandon was like, yeah, we should still bring, like, a few things. So I had, like, PJs and my skincare, makeup, all of that stuff. I wish I had a little mirror because I can see my hair. gonna have to be good enough since we didn't plan to like go to Laguna I don't have any like Laguna wrecks or anything but we're gonna go to like a coffee shop and just go to breakfast at Brandon's places that he likes so if you guys are watching this vlog and you're like oh you need to go here and do all this you can still comment any Laguna Rex because I'm going to want to come back since I'm only going to be here for the morning. But this was just so sudden and last minute. But Brandon like grew up going to Laguna. He's been here so many times because since he's from Vegas, it's pretty close to get here. So he has like his spots that he likes, which will be nice because he can take me to whatever he likes to go to. I'm just gonna do like a really light makeup look. So I did my sunscreen and then I'm just doing the flawless filter just so I can have like a little bit of coverage. I filmed a makeup look. It's like my no foundation makeup look in one of my last vlogs and I'm not even gonna do as much products as that day because I like have no time but I like to just do those two so funny because I could tell that Brandon didn't really want to stay the night because he was saying that when you like stay the night so late like we got the room at two in the morning it's kind of a waste of money because we don't even get like the whole day here we don't get the whole weekend so we were thinking about just like replanning a separate Laguna trip or LA trip where we could actually have the whole weekend. But he could see that I was like really tired and that I wanted to stay because I'm like, it's still fun to like get breakfast and coffee. And so he booked the room and then I was like, oh my God, yay. And he's like, anything for you? Like I would not do this for anybody else except you. And I was like, well, you're the best. <laughs> I am so grateful because he's like so good to me. And if there's something that I like really want, he's just like very accommodating, which I just appreciate so much. And I was like, I want to go to a cute coffee shop and stuff. He's like, okay, like we can do that. <laughs> so nice. Just finished getting ready and wanted to show you guys the outfit. Have on this black sweatshirt that I just like tied around so it could just lay over. And then the Lululemon Align bra, line shorts, Nike socks, and sneakers. I'm just waiting for Brandon to get back because he went to get a banana and yeah, he's putting our name down for a reservation for food. This is probably the shortest amount of time I've ever stayed in a hotel room. It was actually kind of nice though because last night we were telling the guy that since it was at 2 a.m. we were getting the room, it was such a short stay. And then he was like, I'm gonna give you a discount. Like I'll give you a deal on the room. And we're like, wow, that is so nice of you to do that. Because we're already like leaving. I'm just gonna pack up. Yeah. This duffel bag has been so useful. I feel like I've gotten to use it more lately because I've been on some trips. Should have put my jewelry on. I was looking on the maps for a couple different 
coffee shops and oh he's calling hi babe hey i'm just gonna run across the street put our name down at this place is that cool yeah what's it called uh it's called well no <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> I'll just pick you up. I'll just see it. Uh, plus, I don't know if we can even get it, so we're gonna try. Okay. Right. You said no. Uh, no. Okay, love you. Bye, love you, bye. He's so funny. He knows me so good. Cause if I didn't like it, he probably would have been. I would have said like, let's go somewhere else. He's like, no, you just need to trust me. And go with the spot that I think. So that's funny. Well. We're gonna get breakfast first, apparently. I was thinking we were gonna get coffee first, so I was looking at coffee shops, and they have like Laguna Coffee Co., and then there's a place called, I think it's Black Dot, and then there was another one that looked cute. I think I wanna go to Black Dot. I just like the vibe, it like, looked like a cute aesthetic. I think I'm gonna do my chunkier hoops, just cause I like these ones when my hair is back. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out, you guys. There's a spider in the bed. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, is this a joke? Holy shit. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, it's huge. Oh my god, you guys. I am like, literally, look how close it is to my bag and my phone. Oh my god, that is disgusting! What do I do? What do I do? I know, I'm like literally being such a girl right now. That is so bad! Okay, I'm going to... Oh, it's moving! Oh, it's so creepy! Oh my god. Okay, everything's fine, everything's fine. Good thing we're leaving. What's up? So, well then they can see the view. Oh, I'm saying they can see the view. Oh. Look how cute this is. Where are you going? Oh. So cute. some black coffee they don't have any milk substitutes so stepping out of my comfort zone here I know. But you like it I do it's actually good yeah. we just got our food I got two poached eggs their potatoes it looks so bomb and then some ham a side Thank of fruit much. strawberries pineapple orange we even got poached eggs and ham oatmeal all the toppings. The breakfast was just so good. Now we're just right outside by the beach and it's so pretty. Brandon just took some photos of me right here and it's just so gorgeous. Also the air smells so good. <laughs> He's looking at me. <laughs> He's like, we need to go. I'm like, okay. <laughs> also, I'm gonna give you guys a car tour, but we're gonna drive to like another spot. So when we get there, I'll show you. Shopping at Laguna Coffee Co. It's a really cute coffee shop right here. And it's kind of busy, but I'm excited. Should be good. Yeah. Thank you. Ready? Yeah. Actually, 
she have to grab my hand. No, I got it. I got it. Huh? Let's go. Come on, no. Babe. I'll pay. I'll pay. Does not let me pay for anything. <laughs> Kind of busy. It's popping fun. Sure. Are you getting iced or hot? Uh, I think I'm gonna wait. You're not gonna get anything? Their hot cups are cute. I might want hot. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Thank you. It looks so good. Thank you so much. <laughs> We just found a spot to park so we can show you the car and it is so pretty. Brandon Super is very cool. excited about it. Hell yeah. Are you ready to show them? Show. Your new car? Show. Okay guys. Here is the new Audi R8. And it is stunning. It's pretty. We love her. The back is so pretty. Also, it's like interesting because the engine is in the back of the car. So, in the front, can you pop it so they can see? Pop what? The hood. The front thing? Yeah. Or I guess it's not, is it the hood? The front. The, fr <laughs> the front. <laughs> so literally in the front of the car is where you store stuff. Like, is how weird is that? Sick. It's super small, but this is where you can put like your groceries. The inside, it's kind of full in here because we have all of our stuff. But I'll open the door and show you guys. Our stuff is literally everywhere. What's up, brother? But this is what it looks like. It's so pretty. Brandon is inside 7-Eleven right now. We're just stopping before we get on the road. He's gonna get a protein bar, but I still have my coffee from Laguna Coffee Co. It's such a cute coffee shop. If you go to Laguna, I don't even know if this is like a top recommendation, but I thought it was so cute in there. And I love that they have like butterflies on the cups. We are heading back to Vegas now just because we want to get back at a good hour and we have dinner plans tonight so we have like a four-ish hour drive ahead of us but i just wanted to update you guys what is going on i love the car it is so pretty brings back the i8 vibes if you guys are new to my channel brandon used to have a bmw i8 and he sold it because he made money off of it so he wanted to get um the money for it just because it was like so good to sell and then he got his wagon which we call the swagon and it's just like this bmw wagon that's a diesel and it's a really good car to drive like to work every day and it gets good gas mileage so he loves having that as a daily car and then he just wanted to get like a new sports car that could be fun for him to drive he found it like a little while ago and then had contacted the guy and the guy was so nice, so it was definitely good that we came out to buy it because it's such a beautiful car and he was just a really good person. And so, I don't know, I'm just happy that it all worked out because sometimes when you like go buy things from other people or buy cars or whatever, you don't really know what you're gonna get. So the fact that it was like in such good condition and there's like no scratches, everything is just like so perfect so worked out really well and the car isn't like a brand new car obviously it's um a 2009 i believe i can't remember but it's like kind of older it's not like brand new but it definitely looks still like so pretty and i'm obsessed with it it's a very loud car but i didn't really do a good job of showing the inside earlier just because i was like in a rush but this is what it looks like we're just doing a quick stop at the gas station. I'm gonna see if there's a snack that I want. Maybe a bar. Or I think I would want like a nut mix. I feel like I should just get something like this, yeah? Yeah, sure. They have it with mango. I don't you think like the flavor. They're not good? Just get the regular. They're all like bent. <laughs> it does. Hello. I think we are good. It's, is it 1.57? The car says 12. I know, and it says it's May or April 17th. Huh? Yeah, we need to change that. 
That's because of daylight savings though, the time. The date though? That's weird. This yeah. guy's living in the future. <laughs> <laughs> it's so small in here. Yeah. Like you guys, look at my room. Cause there's no space for like my bag. So yeah, it's like all stuff. Right? What? Yeah. We're being awesome. careful. 